Gemini, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, reading on you and the energy surrounding you. Keep in mind that it is not going to resonate with each and every Gemini or Gemini placement, but feel free to check previous future reads or your other placements for more different information. Okay, so I'm getting that someone wants to like skip ahead, skip to the good part. All right, so you may be talking to somebody here and somebody's definitely trying to like skip ahead to a matter of importance in the conversation, okay? Like just let's like cut to the chase, get to what it is you want to talk about, okay? Because that's interesting because this is your, there's a conversational piece here for sure. All right. There's someone that you're wanting to talk to, but you're resisting it. Like you feel this is a bad situation or something is amiss or like we're not treating each other properly. This person, you know, I still need something. I still lack here, but they're not doing anything and neither am I. Okay. So like you, you look really bored with someone of a situation. I just saw one, one, one there, but it's like, you're not wanting to reach out. You're, you're not going to take the initiative. It's like, no, I'm not going to ask you for help. I'm not going to ask you for assistance. Like, shouldn't you already know that? Okay. Hmm. So you're bored with your situation right now, Gemini. You want it to change. You're looking forward to something moving. All right. It's like, all right, when is this going to change? Cut to the chase. Let's get to the good part. Yeah, let's get to the good part. Are you waiting for a date here? Some of you guys are. Who is this person, please, in Gemini's reading? Or the energy surrounding you? What is this? Hold on one second. Yeah. I'm hearing way back. Way back machine. Why are you guys having a standoff here? Who is this person, please, in Gemini's reading? I'm getting Taurus energy here. All right. Nightmare. You guys are having some sort of like stagnant vibe, but no one is doing anything. I do feel like you're irritated or you used to be, but now you just don't care anymore. You're just like, why would I care? You know, this person's not asking me for what they need and I'm not going to be asking them. So you have the double card popping out. All right, maybe it's a Capricorn energy, but definitely some interesting behavior is being displayed on both parts here. You're not acting like yourself. This is what I'm getting or someone's telling you that. Gemini, you're not acting like yourself. You're not being who you normally are. Okay, what is it? Yeah, this person still believes that you and them are going to work something out eventually. I'm getting the word eventually. Let me see Gemini in this vibe. What is this, please? Yeah, okay. Wow. So someone just wants to be alone? Okay, what in the world? Let me see Gemini, please. It's like, I, yeah, how do you see this person? You just wanna be alone, Gemini? You've been disappointed to that extent here, like you need some space, all right? Yeah. Someone's not allowing you and them to like heal a situation, okay? Like the wound is still fresh regardless. Whatever happened here, it's like you got you don't want to forgive them, okay? It's like one of those things, I can't forgive you at this time or I won't be able to forgive you for this specifically. Something's going on. Who is this? Who is in the reading? Yep, there it is. There are you guys holding back from each other with your little standoff energy here. You guys are having a standoff. Okay, I'm hearing something about Mexican food. What's going on over here? Yep, yeah, you're a lover's energy. Okay, so this person's still in love with you. Like, I'm telling you, this is somebody who's like, yeah, we have a connection. Okay, yeah. Me and Gemini have a real strong connection. I love Gemini. Okay, that's what this is. Okay, who is this? I mean, exactly. Why are you guys doing this? 
All right, this person doesn't feel loved right now. I don't think you care about that, okay? Because this is more so like someone left you hanging in a time of need or when they should have reached out or they should have said something. And this person's worried about their feelings, not yours. So maybe that's what you're upset about. It's like Gemini, you know, I'm just not gonna talk to you because I'd rather you be um, thinking about me more often or wondering about me as opposed to me coming after you or chasing you or something like that. This is someone who feels like they need to like stay put and they're, they're operating out of scarcity mindset, whoever this is, okay? Um, they want you to come forward. Look, it's like, oh, I need Gemini to come in. Gemini needs to come give me love. Show me how much you care by taking action toward me, Gemini. Like I'm the one who wants love. I need love here, okay? And in the meantime, I'm gonna hold back so you feel the burn, so you feel the sting, so you feel like you yeah they're trying to prompt you to take action toward them so they know that you care gemini but the thing is you're mad at them about something so why would you do that right because you're telling me here like you're upset with something that this person did or said it looks like did to me but whatever it's like or didn't do that's what this is someone didn't do something toward you and you're holding on to that you're like this is not the type of tea I want. I ordered like I don't. I don't want this situation. Yeah. Okay. Let me pull you some cards. It's really interesting about this moon card individual. We're gonna get to that. I'm, okay. Show me. Yeah. Okay. Show me Gemini. This person's like. If anything, you're just over it. Yeah. Justice. You're coming out with like power justice energy hello this is the back of the queen of swords okay you've had it with this person might be a leo whoever this is could be a water sign for some of you but this this is you like i've had it i'm pissed you know enough is enough you need to deal with this i'm hearing shell shocked okay like you need to deal with the aftermath because this is your problem now all right it's like i'm not having this so your tower energy is coming out i feel like you got pissed or like you just had it up to here is what i'm hearing up to here Okay. Something about your third eye. Okay, let me see how you see this person here. That's the thing. Yeah, the two. This person's like always holding back, but also holding on to you at the same time it's like they always preserve something for themselves here or like they won't completely open up to you at times and at other times it's this feels like on their terms like they're trying to have more control over the situation here or they were yeah knight of pentacles it's like a holding pattern you know that this person is gonna go away and like have a holding pattern here so i feel like this is why the the d energy is coming out here all right with that that unalive card, that transformation card, the reaper here. It's like, now you want to switch up or now you want to act like you're there or you're waiting or you're, it's so interesting. Yeah, again, the ace of wands here for this. It's right there again. Someone needs to like clear the air with you. Someone needs to like do the right thing according to you. Like you feel like, okay, I'm gonna go do something else right now. Like you're feeling an urge for a brand new beginning. You're facing this transformation energy, this transformative energy, like with a passion. You're like, okay, I am going to end this. I am going to face this. I'm, I'm just going right through because whatever's going on right now is annoying me. Okay, this is what I'm seeing. Like this person wasn't being honest. You may feel like you don't feel like you're getting turned off is what it is. It's like I can't feel any type of way about you. Like at first, maybe I thought, or I used to, I used to be, you know, turned on by you. I used to feel like I could chase after you or I, or like we could chase after each other, you know, hearing something about tag, you're it. Okay. But now I don't want to, like, I'm not feeling it. Like you, you're trying to be all mysterious and like, you know, you have something going on and it actually backfires and turns me off. It doesn't make me more interested. It makes me less interested. This is what this looks. Look at this person over here, this Leo vibe individual. Yeah, this is, yeah, I was just thinking that. I was like, okay, is this some Aquarius energy, some Leo energy? It is, okay. 
So they oppose here. This is someone who's happier, just kind of flaunting or being out there. This is how they're showing up right now even. Like they could be trying to show off so that you're interested or they're keeping space or you're interested or whatever this is and you kind of feel like this is some sort of a game. Yeah, I feel like it is or it seems that way to you because it's, it's there, you could poke holes in their story any day is what I'm hearing, okay? Yeah, it's like you're not who you say you are. You're not who you pretend to be. So there's some sort of pretense here with this individual but I am seeing for the most part this is someone who is in their own vibe, keeping their space, keeping their distance and feeling good about that. Like they're okay with that. They're good. Okay. This person is just all acting mysterious and stuff, but they really are, even if they haven't been that way is fake it till you make it. So they really are keeping away from you. And that's what they're trying to do. They're not trying to give too much attention or yeah, it's more so like this is someone that you would see doing stuff so that people will notice. Okay, definitely some ego vibes going on here. Hmm, let me see this, this Gemini vibe. There it is, they're seeing you with this moon card energy, okay, and the two of swords, wow. What's this? Two of cups, well, this person feels like you and them have a very, very strong connection here, okay? You yourself, you may have something else coming your way or another passion that is lighting your flame, lighting your fire. It could be another person for some of you. And this is how somebody is aware of that. Like, they may be aware that you have, like, a vibe with someone else. Like, you, you're getting on with someone else now. Like, you're getting along with this person. And this is someone who's, yeah... They feel, the thing is, this person, no matter what's going on here, okay, they're waiting. They're in a period of waiting or like you guys are tapped out, time out type of energy. This person's faking it till they make it, but they feel some type of urge towards you or this is how they see you. Like you guys have this love connection, period. At the end of the day, we love each other. At the end of the day, you know, um, we connect. Really? So show me this. I'm also saying that this person could be like wondering who you're talking to, Gemini, or like who you who you're in bed with, who you're sharing a bed with specifically, like literally sleeping next to. I don't know why, but that's what they're thinking about here. I wonder where Gemini is either sleeping, spending the night. I wonder who Gemini is doing that with, okay? That's what they're concerned about. So they're very territorial over sleeping scenarios or situations. Maybe they feel like they own a bed. I don't know what that means, okay? Your bed could be the only thing I could think. Maybe somebody got someone a bed or they claim the bed. I don't know, all right? Listen. Yeah, so here's the thing, okay? This is someone who's not interested in this lack situation. Like, they feel like you and them don't have a vibe right now. Like, you and them, um, either you're not giving to them or they're not giving to you. And you both are kind of looking like this. Like, you're aware that this person's holding back in some sense. But they're, it's like they're having trouble letting go, walking away completely, even if they feel this isn't it right now. It's, it's really interesting, okay? Yeah. yeah, they're not happy is what it is. Like something's missing with you guys. And so that's why they sneak off or they, it's like, I'm not getting what I need here. It's something like that. All right, let me see here. Well, you're holding steady. Your main thing here is perseverance. I'm finishing what I started, okay? So this is you holding on to what happiness looks like to you, what freedom looks like to you, or like what you need in your life to make you happy and what that looks like. This is what you're holding on to. Like you have this idea of, no, I'm committed to my happiness, so I'm gonna stick with it, or I'm gonna follow through with what I started here. And to me, this looks like your ending, but what else? I see that you're not giving up hope or faith for like, um, 
future I'm hearing future responsibilities, but I feel like relationships. Okay, you're like, no, someone's out there for me or something is out there for me or whatever this is. Like there's another opportunity right around the corner. I know it. Okay, so I am seeing a huge like spiritual energy here. I don't know if you're a reader or you're um, psychic to some sense or like you're just very spiritual or religious, but that's also coming into this. So this is where your strength will be coming from during this time. Okay, like leaning on your belief systems here. This is what I see. And I also see that you are not wanting to speak to this person. It's like, I know what I know. And this is my mode of function and action right now is continuing what I just started. Okay. So it looks like the tower. Yeah. It's like smithereens, babe. Okay. Maybe something about Looney Tunes here. Um, hmm. Let me see this here, please cartoons all right okay they're not wanting you to know <laughs> i'm telling you this is someone who doesn't want you to know that they're they have total intentions of coming back together with you or reconciling a difference with you to like tell you what they're thinking okay specifically like they want to be able to see if in the future you guys can after some space or after some time or after whatever if you guys can like trust each other if you guys can get sweet again you guys can like each other again you guys can kiss and make up or whatever this is this person is thinking about that here and they're waiting until they like hear from you or they're waiting until you come back around because it looks like you actually pulled the plug on this situation and this person is pretending like they're unfazed it's not true i'm telling you right now it is not friggin true here this person is feeling all types of things and they're doing their best to let go having a little difficulty and they're like you know what in the future we'll talk at least they hope that's what they're, they're like i hope that we will okay that's what this is no wonder they came out with this hope card all right yeah they're not happy with the current state i'm hearing state of affairs anyway next two weeks Gemini and this person, this Leo, Eight of Swords, Gemini vibes. Yeah, so here's the thing. You're not sure if you should make up with this person in the next week, and they're also not sure if they should make the first move in the next week. And I'm telling you because we did say that this person's waiting for your advancement. I'm not telling you to do anything here because you look like your mind is made up. If anything, you look like your mind is made up about this right now, at least. And we're talking two weeks here. You're trying to let this settle, like let the dust settle and then basically carry on with your decisions, what it is. But this person's like thinking, hey, how can we get, you know, should I say something? They're, they're feeling like it's a little bit of a risk to do so. Yeah, because they're aware of what it is that you said, what you did or like your actions which right now looks like inaction from them or from you, I mean, yeah. So they know that you're trying to be on your own. Like you just wanna be alone, like leave me alone or get out of my home or I have to leave, I'm moving or whatever this is moving away from you, okay? Yeah, it is. Show me Gemini in the next two weeks. There's still some holding on to this vibe with you. So the two of pentacles, Okay, Capricorn energy, Aries Scorpio energy. Okay, I'm hearing something about dairy um, or like plant-based. Okay. It looks like you're trying to just keep yourself in check here. What is this though? I mean, we, we already said that, so. Yeah, here it is, okay. You're still not interested in picking things back up. You have like this bitter taste with this person. You're thinking about it or you will have an opportunity to think about this in the next two weeks. You're not feeling it though. Emotionally, you're just no. It's no, it's no for me. It's a no for me is what it is. However, some of you guys, you may have a past person popping up, even if it's not this specific person, like you have another past person popping up here too. I'm just saying general dissatisfaction. Some of you guys may feel like something is not right. Something is not perfect, okay? Um, 
just generally kind of like blah about things or blase. It's just like, yeah, I could, I could hang out with them. I could accept this offer. I could, you know, but I'm not sure that I want to. Like some of you guys may feel like you just kind of want to stick to yourself here. You will have offers coming your way in the next two weeks, okay? Two specifically is what I'm seeing, but you feel like n neither of these are what you want. It's like whatever, okay? That's what it is. It's like blah, okay? Why are you offering me that same crap over and over? I'm getting something about cereal. Yeah, there's a Capricorn here. Ooh, Sagittarius vibes, okay? Yeah, Ace of Cups. You guys are trying to like fight the urge to like link up with people here or someone's doing this toward you, okay? Some of you guys are tempering some um, some afflictions you may have, like you could be trying to be healthier in whatever way that means to you. This is like, I need to be healthy physically, mentally, emotionally. That's really important to you in the next two weeks from what I'm seeing. And you're making decisions from that lens. It's like, this is the way that you're seeing things. Yeah, that's what it is. Like you're, you're reassociating yourself or like you're realigning with your goals and what it is you truly want here. Tell me one more. You'll have an opportunity to tell somebody this if you want. Yeah. No, you're freeing yourself from a cycle. Yeah. Yes, you are. There is a cycle here. There's a general dis dissatisfaction with a particular person, and this cycle is closing. I love you so very much, Gemini. Feel free to check previous future reads, your other placements for more or different information. Friends, family members, neighbors, coworkers, peep and Tom, peep and Tony, and I'll straight check their placements too, so we know what they're up to. Kisses. Love you. Boy.